513 on our Thursday morning and yesterday, officially spring, but feeling a lot like uh, winter this morning. Yes, I put the heat back on the car this mm -hmm. morning. Yep. I was kind of Needed disappointed. To. You had, had, to, yeah. had to do it, it I was think. A chilly. I actually pulled out my thick, thick winter jacket. I didn't today. do that. Yeah. Will I regret that later? No, I mean, if you have like a, if you're just running out to your car or yes. something like that. But if, if I was but if you, outside? Yes. I listened you to you and outside. I brought it. So oh, you did? Yeah, you yeah, did. Yeah. Okay. I just, Very it was kind of like pushed back mm -hmm. and so I went, one But I, I know that feeling where I'm like, I don't want to yeah. do it just out of like. It's March 21st. Yes. I don't yeah. want to. This I is true. And the thing about it is too, if you go out to your car today, right, in January it would be bitterly cold in the car, but that March sun is so strong that it wasn't horrible. Just don't park in the shade today and you're good to go. But this morning, of course, no sun to help warm us up. We're at 28 degrees right now, but the wind is at 16 miles an hour sustained. You know, a morning low of 28 this time of year is not that far-fetched. I mean, it's pretty close to normal. The problem is the readings don't go up much today, and we're going to stay windy all day long. So we're going to have more of that January feel today, but at least we will see that March sunshine mixed with just a few clouds. So the wind chill right now is 16 in Springfield. We have wind chills uh, as low as the single digits across the hill towns right now. So as the kids head off to the bus stop, temperatures coming down a couple more degrees. Make sure the kids are bundled up, full winter gear. As they're heading home this afternoon, upper 30s, again, at least we have that March sun, but with the wind, it's going to make it feel like it's in the teens and 20s today. The top number is your temp. The middle number or the bottom number here, that is your wind chill. So at noon today, temps in the mid-30s, wind chills in the lower 20s, wind chills stay in the 20s. Now this is for the valley, this is for Springfield, so knock off about another 10 for the hill towns and for the higher terrain. And the wind is going to be strongest across elevated areas as well. That's why we have a wind advisory for the hill towns and for Berkshire County, went into effect at 5 o'clock. It stays into effect all day today and into the evening. This is where we could have winds gusting over 50. I think in the valley, winds will gust close to 40. So the best chance of any damaging winds today, elevated areas. That's where we could have uh, perhaps some isolated power outages. So for your day today, trash can wind meter, we'll put it at a two, two and a half with those winds strong and temperatures low. So certainly a cold one today. Notice the flow coming in from the northwest. We had that strong front move through yesterday with some rain, snow showers, even a few snow squalls. Maine picking up big snows right now, or at least a few inches of snow. Central and northern New England's going to get a big snowstorm on Saturday while we get a soaking rain. There may be some snow for us, especially along Route 2 in northern Berkshire County, but most of the valley, it is indeed going to be rain this go-around. The cold air is going to retreat just enough that it would be rain. We're going to see some energy coming out of the middle part of the nation, coming in out of the Gulf. It's going to gather, slide to the coast. But while that's happening, the cold air is easing just a bit. And so just enough that you have to onset, we might have some wet snow, but the bulk of this is going to be rain uh, for just about all of Western Mass. Again, some accumulations uh, uh, across maybe, say, along Route 2. Um, so a place like Coraine, north of Greenfield, maybe uh, Peru could pick up a couple of inches before going over to rain uh, Saturday morning. The bulk of the snow, all the snow, central and northern New England, the green and white mountains are going to make out with a massive snowstorm. So for us today, temperatures in the 30s, wind chills, though, in the teens and 20s. Then tonight, the wind relaxes, frigid start tomorrow, but a better day. Less wind, not as cold, lower 40s, 30s Friday night and Saturday, and then it's Saturday morning, maybe a bit of wet snow along Route 2, northern Berkshire County, and then a change over to a soaking rain for Saturday. It should exit the region by Sunday. We'll talk more about your weekend forecast coming up in a few minutes from now. Amanda and David, what are you? Thanks, Dan.